Hello everybody today. In this video, I am going to read story Hansel and Gretel. So let's study. Once upon a time, there lived a very poor woodcutter with his two children, Hansel and Gretel, in a tiny cottage in the forest. His wife had died and his second wife ill-treated the children. She always complained that there was not enough to eat and they had too many mouths to feed. If only we did not have the children, she told the woodcutter. We would get by very well. The woodcutter was horrified, but his wife went on. Tomorrow, you are going to take children deep into the forest and leave them there. It broke the woodcutter's heart. But... He had to agree to do his evil wife's bidding. Hansel and Gretel overheard them talking and Gretel began weeping. Do not worry, sister, Hansel said. I shall find a way and bring us both safely back home. When their parents went to sleep that night, the boy slipped out of the house through the back door and collected all the shiny white pebbles he could find and put them in his pocket. He came back to bed again. The next day, the woodcutter took Hansel and Gretel deep inside the forest. As they walked, Hansel dropped the pebbles on the ground. Their father told them to collect sticks for fire that night and making an excuse disappeared. Night fell, but the woodcutter did not return. After quite some time, the children were sure that their father had left them behind. Gretel began to cry. Hansel too felt scared, but he tried to hide his feelings and comfort his sister. Do not cry, Hansel said in an assuring voice to his sister. I can get us both home. Come, I'll show you. Taking his sister's hand, Hansel showed her the path that he created with the help of the shiny white pebbles. They reached their house, the crack of dawn while their father was overjoyed to see them again. The stepmother was far from happy. She made the woodcutter promise to bring his children back to the forest and leave them there for good. We are better off, she reasoned, as would they be. That night, when Hansel tried to sneak out, he found that all the doors and windows of the house had been bored shut. This time he could not gather that shiny white pebbles to leave a trail. The next morning, the stepmother gave them a piece of stale bread and a sip of water for breakfast. Hansel put his piece of bread in his pocket. He crumbled it up in this and this time used the bread crumbles to leave trail from their home till the herd of the forest. As just previously their father slipped away and did not come back for them, he left his two children by themselves. How will we get back home, Hansel? Frittle asked, worried. For the sun was starting to set. The children discovered that the birds had eaten every last one of the bread crumbs. There was no thrill to follow back home. The children found a soft bed of leaves and moss and slept huddled together that night, feeling cold and lonely in the middle of the deep dark forest. When dawn broke, 
they started to wander about the forest, seeking a path. But all hope soon faded. They were well and truly lost. They walked and walked till suddenly they came across a gingerbread house. The children were very hungry as they did not have any dinner the previous night. They ran towards the house and began nibbling it. The old woman who lived inside the house came running out and called. To continue the story, please subscribe to my channel and don't forget to press the bell icon.